Uh, we are live. Uh, good afternoon, Vietnam, and good evening, Australia. For someone who doesn't know much about me or my pitch, uh, firstly, uh, let me introduce myself. My name is Thanh Le from Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam, and now I'm working as an admin for a big company of a multinational corporation. And today I'm so happy to have a new friend, a partner from Sydney, Australia on my page. And it's so special for, for me because this is the first time I make a go live in English with a foreign <laughs> partner. Hello there. How are you? Good, thanks. Uh, thank you, Dave, for accepting my invitation and you're here on my page. And thank you so much for everything you have me in the previous time. And uh, Dave, please uh, introduce yourself that my uh, audience can know more about you. Who are you and what are you doing? Um, I'm David, as Hang said. I'm from Sydney, Australia. I'm 55. I um, have two, two adult children, a daughter 22. My son is 19. Um, they're very independent, so I'm, I'm quite quite happy they can help themselves. Um, I've always had outdoor manual labour work which included 13 years in the army. But due to an accident I had in the army long, quite a few years ago, I had to leave the army because I hurt my knee in both my ankles. Mm. Now what I do is I have a small gardening business, mm. but the problem with that, the last two weeks in Sydney it has been raining. And it's just, I'm sitting in my garage now. This is my office and it's raining now. It just started. So it's very hard because I work for myself. And if I don't work, I don't get paid. No one pays me holiday pay. No one pays me sick pay. No one pays me if I don't go to work. So it's very hard. And so that's about it. Mm -hmm. Quite basic. Uh, thank you, Deb. Uh, can you tell me also with our audience, uh, how can you know about this uh, business and why did you choose this um, to decide to do this business? Um, just one day I was looking on Facebook and I come across this ad about this business. And I was, I thought I'm interested because I can't keep doing the work I'm doing because it's too hard for my body. Mm -hmm. So I thought I'll look into this. I'll have a look. Um, I friended the person that put the ad on. She happens to live in Sydney, about one hour drive from where I lived. Mm -hmm. We became friends and I was, you know, build up trust between each other and she I said so what's this business that you're doing and she described it to me she explained it and but she also said you don't have to join the business just to be my friend okay yeah don't feel pushed that you have to join this business so I found it on Facebook I looked at a webinar for more information mm -hmm. and I thought this is something I can do. But what I did first, and this is important for anyone listening, this is what I did first, research. Don't just jump in and say I'm going to do this because mm -hmm. there's a lot of online businesses out there. But I guarantee more than 50% are scams. Okay? But I can guarantee this one's not, all right? So what I did was research. I went away. I thought about it. I came back to my friend. I said, yeah, I'm ready. And then Good. she guided me She guided me to the next step. I took that next step, and then I took the next step, and now here I am. Yeah. Uh, congrats on you. 
and I'm happy you are here. <laughs> and uh, uh, can you tell me what challenge do you get in this uh, business when you start uh, this business? The biggest challenge. The biggest challenge was I've never done online business before. Oh, the same thing. I have my I have my own garden business, which I can do. I can do with my eyes closed because it's easy. I know what I'm doing. But with the online business, completely different. I didn't know what to do. Mm -hmm. But the person who, the person who's that I answered, she's my coach now. She gives me a lot of advice. Mm -hmm. um, there's a lot of training involved. I'm involved with a big community of people. So, and I can post something on Facebook question um can you someone this help me with this i have a problem here oh, and i'm yeah. always i've always got help mm -hmm. so my initial struggles were i've never done online business i'm not brewing on a computer i i can use email i can look at the internet i can write a word document but nothing else you know i'm not not that smart so they were initial struggles, but the more I got into the business, the more I learned, the more from people, people like you yourself, like we weren't, we didn't know each other until three months ago. And you've taught me a lot. Other, other friends have taught me a lot. And so it's made my struggle. When I say struggle, it's not really a struggle. It was, um, uh, it was just adapting to something new because I've never done this before. I'm mm -hmm. not a businessman. A lot of people in this business aren't business people either. They're just like me, normal people, and want to join an online business. And once you do, you see how it's not it's not easy. You still have to get up and go to work. Don't think, don't think. Yeah, I've got an online business and. That's it. it. It's working. No, you have to still do some work. Yeah, yeah. You still have to wake up and do the job. It's your job. It's your business. Um, for me, uh, I get a lot of uh, challenges about English. <laughs> Firstly, I can I can uh, speak yeah, a little bit. I can write a little bit. I can hear a little bit. And um, I get a lot of challenges about uh, IT. So I'm so nervous when I uh, appear on social media platform. I'm so scared because before I am always standing in my comfort zone. And when I jump in to this business, I have to go out my comfort zone and do everything I never do before. And uh, when I do bit business i uh, have to work with a lot of different platform uh, on the internet that i never did before and um, then i learn uh, and about my uh, my english i'm not so confident uh, to speak even though i uh, i i uh, studied english in my university um, but I'm always care English. Uh, oh my gosh, it's so funny <laughs> when I decide when I decide to become an uh, entrepreneur. I uh, try my best to learn from training sites, so it's difficult for me because everything uh, is English. Videos are English, text uh, English, and then I think if I want to do this business, I the only way is learning learning and learning mm, so yeah, uh, yeah uh, i learn by training side i learn from other uh, business partners i learn from my uh, coach my uh, mentor so today i'm here <laughs> i can do as you can see <laughs> yeah and i'm proud of you okay and like <laughs> we've helped each other before okay like uh, okay and stepping out of your comfort zone is good. 
I stepped yeah. out of my comfort zone to join an online business where you've done two things. You've stepped out of your comfort zone mm -hmm. yeah. to speak English yeah. and the online business. Yeah. And uh, thank you, Deb. You have me so much. When I say, Deb, I'm so nervous to interview on, <laughs> on my page. You, you said that. Don't worry, I teach you. Thank you so much, Dave. And today, um, appear on my page. <laughs> and I'm proud of you. Very good. Well done. Uh, <laughs> thank you, my teacher. <laughs> thank you, my friends, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Dave, the last question for you: uh, What's the most thing yeah, do you love this business? Okay. Well, number number one. Okay, which is probably not everyone's number one. But all the, the friends I've met, you, you know, I, I interviewed with your sister-in-law on Saturday. Um, I've met so many other new people around the world, not just Sydney, around the world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's number one for me. New, new the contacts. The same for me. Yeah, new, yeah. New, new contacts, new network. Yeah. The second, going back to business, is the automated system, okay? Someone just has to look at my website there, click onto that, put their name, email address in, watch a webinar, um, find out more information. Maybe they can contact me again, or maybe mm -hmm. they take the next step, and then they'll, they'll have 30 days of emails describing the business. And then it's up to them to opt in or opt out. It's it's no one's pushing anyone to get into this, okay? Yeah. That's the beauty of this is no calling like calling five times a day. Oh, are you are you going to join? You want to join? You want to do this? Do that? No one does that. Yeah, yeah. When I when I took the next step, my coach, well, the lady that who I first met, she's now my coach. We just continued our friendship. She didn't mention business at all. She just let it go. And then it was my decision. So there's no no pressure there. And then if I get a lead and they want to opt in, it goes to my sales funnel, which the sales funnel, like I said, I can operate a computer. I can write a Word document. I can do Excel. I can do email, surf the internet. Anyone can do that. But I had to build a sales funnel. I would have no idea how to do that. <laughs> but the team behind me in the background, they did. They built the sales funnel and it was all built for me. I didn't have to do a thing. It was all built for me. Um, the, the woman that um, built the funnel for me, her name is Rachel. I think she's in Canada. I'm pretty sure she's in Canada. Contacted me all the time, every day. Contact me, Dave. It's set up. Are you right? Do you know how to operate? Yep, that, thank you. So it's all automatic. If I get a lead, it goes into the sales funnel, and then they receive emails for more information. And um, nothing I need to do really. Like I said, I still need to get up, go to work, log on, have a look at my emails. If someone asks me a question, it's not it's not good business if you wait three days, four days to answer an, an email. You need to, like, yeah, one day, one one day. No one expects you to answer in five minutes, but if you wait one day, that, that's, a, that's a good time frame. Mm -hmm. But if you wait five days and then answer an email, the people lose interest. So this is, this is the work you have to do. We're not we're not selling things we're not selling anything yeah that's the beauty of this i'm in my garage now this is my office this is where i work i love it i walk out of my front door and i walk here and i'm at work it's so uh, flexible it's flexible exactly i can take my phone to the park next door yeah or i can go to the beach and read email i can log on and do some more training so I can do it anywhere I want, okay? I don't have to go to an office. Where I live in Sydney, I'm about 
30 minutes by train to the city but i used to work in the city and sometimes i would drive and sometimes it could take one hour or more to get to work now when i'm doing this online business i'm at home this is my office where i live i can sit on the lounge and watch tv oh there's an email i just have a look at that <laughs> yeah that's what i love about this there's no and there's, you know you know and if i've got a problem i can just ask anyone if my coach and my mentor actually my mentor lives in canada mm -hmm. and my coach is in sydney so always one is awake you know what i mean but i don't want to bother them all the time so if i put a question someone will always answer i'm in a team of about 45 maybe 50 now because every day there's a new person coming into the team i can put a question in our group email chat and someone will answer it here you go dave this is what you do here oh thank you that's what i love about this um that's everything i love <laughs> and you said that i love flexibility and i can work anytime anywhere when i go shopping with my children i can uh, use my of my phone and do this business uh, when i go um, to my uh, go go anywhere with my friends uh, such as coffee um how about when you go to the park with that crazy boy uh yeah of course i i yes he's so funny when we talk he puts the makes me into popcorn or something yeah and you're, and you're and, talking you're, you're doing business you're on your email yeah and he's behind me go he, he like do that he likes to so do funny. that he's so funny yes. he says uncle dave look watch me so funny <laughs> thank you Jeff. yeah uh and uh so and the next you said that uh we have uh, no selling we have um, no selling in this uh, business and so i'm i'm so so scared i i don't like to sell anything so when i know about this business i don't have to sell anything oh that's good I, I i like it and so i um researched about this online business many many times oh no selling no backing friends and uh, um, mem member uh, family members oh good so oh, i like it <laughs> that's everything uh, i like in this uh business and one more time we have mentor and coach and community or uh, everyone can have any time i need oh good you I know like when it. i when when i first entered this business ninety thousand ninety thousand 90 000 people in the community now there's more than 120 it's just getting bigger yeah and uh every everyone um i and Dev know uh, each other the don't know each other before but when i reach out Dev and uh, need his help he uh, he helped me so much and freely free free <laughs> I uh, I'm so uh, happy and grateful for everything you do for me. Thank you, Dev. No problem. And, no, no problem. <laughs> thank you, Dev, for sharing today. If uh, everyone has any question about this business, please comment or leave message on my page. Uh, uh, drop your email and and name on my website. I would give you. Uh, full information as soon as possible. Uh, once more, thank you, Dev. Uh, hey, 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 what about my website too? 
Uh, my website, you can see uh, on no, no, the no, banner. No, no, no. <laughs> you said your website. How about my website too? <laughs> ah, sorry. <laughs> yeah, the same. Everyone can uh, leave message or comment and uh, drop email and name on David's website and my website. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Dave. <laughs> and thank you, Dave. Uh, once more, uh, I wish you will get more and more success in your business. And thank you, everyone, for watching today. And see you on my next go live. Thank you so much. Bye for now. Thank you, Tan. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.